Yeah, I've got lots of damage to show in here. Although well, not as bad as the other side. This is a 32 foot. It's a violon, right? Yeah, and it's got it's got a double language in it. And yes. So this so is the rest of the extension. It's amazing. Except I wonder how good it's going to be at reflecting this out rather than absorbing it. Know, it's also just sort of. Although the transite was no better. No, that's true. You know, it's... But here's what I was wondering. Is this relay for the... This is the chamber below and this. That's what I thought. Same on the other side. So those relays are there. So, so we this, actually this could reactivate the, the two center gallery chambers and the two ceiling chambers. I don't think this got terribly wet. There's no, signs it was here and there, but I don't think... It was, it was the other side that got clobbered yeah. so bad. This has the... the the, the Egyptian bazoo, right? That's what this thing is right here? The paper mache one? Yes. That's really cool. That's the one of a kind. Yep. It's interesting, the one thing you never read about were them complaining about electrical problems. So this must have been fairly reliable. You know, I don't recall, you know, you had ciphers, but they seemed like they were always related to the magnets or the chests. In some ways, it would be better if it was all related to the relay. Then you'd know you could fix it. Gallery, gallery one. Oh, good. So that's below. And if we have gallery two, that's the one next to it, right? There's pedal. Gallery. That's good. Gallery three. Fantastic. So it's all here so for this whole side. So we're on house, house right. right. Yeah. Oh, that's good. So we could actually could get the entire right side of the organ to play. Now we got to find out is if these got cut and if the wind up here other than the blower being disconnected if the wind was cut. But otherwise, we could turn this on. This is beautiful pipework. See, now luckily this didn't get wet. That's amazing it didn't get wet looking at it. You can see outside. Um, it's not outside. There's, a, there's something over these. There's some, on, on either side, there's some other spaces. I forget exactly how it's set up. It, um, Air may be able to get through, but it's not. You're not open directly. Right. Out. I know what you're saying. Well, actually, these got it a little bit. It doesn't look like it's insurmountable. It's daylight or something from through there, though, from here. Yeah, that's what we were looking at. Yeah, it's but it's indirect light. Oh, that doesn't mean the wind can't blow the the water. It's definitely daylight because it's the blue the color temperature. Can't see it coming through. And these just these just toppled because they wanted to. I don't think anyone damaged this. Yeah, and that, that wasn't like that. I really? know that wasn't like that. Seriously. I positively remember that that was all there. Well, now why is all this damaged? Some of this got whacked. Boy, and, and I'll, have to look at, I'll have to look at my... See, I don't think this was all like this. And see this? I mean, I can't believe they would have done that, but it's sure right in that spot. You bet. But he was supposedly here telling them what they could do and what they couldn't do. Although that looks pretty fresh to my way things because it's so shiny, but maybe not. Maybe someone just got up here to do something and didn't give a shit. It's right. like a crack Absolutely. here that's very shiny, which means it had to be recent. Well, that's been the biggest frustration to us about seeing this, is of all the damage there is in the organ, more than half has been done during and after this renovation, wouldn't you think? Yep. Other than this, those few areas which you haven't seen that had the severe water damage, all the rest of this has been done when they renovated. All this extra work now wouldn't have been necessary. And you're always weighing that against, well, but they could have thrown the whole organ out. So I guess you figure, we'll take this over nothing. But it's still frustrating. If you look in, you can see the, the reinforcement. Yeah. They recast everything, or they, reca they cast them, and then they just put them in place. But this is all... That's why they can drill through this so easily. Yes. Now, what would they put on like... the other side here? Is this just the way they had to attach the roof? Well, I think it's a sheet metal roof now. Does it say what this is? This is such a cute way. Look at the... Uh, this must have been covered with all that stuff. Because that's what all the cleaning was about, was getting the asbestos out. Yeah, because they did this everywhere. Yep. Look on the end of this. Is it here? Mm -hmm. Let me see. What is the thing? This, I thought, might have been it right here. Yeah, it that. probably was. Is there any more? Somebody probably vacuumed it up. This says... 25 inch, wow, 25 inch wind. 
What's the last one, the bottom well, these, one? These are, uh, the 25 inch ones is the Celeste, Gamba Celeste. Mm -hmm. Back here, maybe? You know, it's just nice because it was in the script, nice script writing like they used to do. Uh, of course, anything original is nice. Eventually, we're probably going to do something similar to this in order to be able to control the temperature in these rooms. We'll have something to seal the airflow off from the uh, grills. And even thin plastic like this wouldn't interfere with the sound all that much. This mentions the bassoon. That's over there. Fire flute, clarabella, chalamue. <laughs> in parentheses, clarinet. <laughs> That's funny. And box. Is that, that would be... At the far end? Looks like the far end. We're in the echo chamber up in the ceiling, and we've got a couple of the unusual reed stops in the organ. Uh, one of the ones that people always ask about is the paper mache bassoon, and that's what this is here. You're seeing the bases of it, and um, it's kind of interesting in that it's what you call a free reed, meaning it has a reed like a harmonica would have. And these also have a tuning wire like a normal reed stop would have. And this is all made out of paper and wood. Probably just had a shellac coating on it or something like that to begin with, which the moisture has discolored. But that's a one of a kind. It has a turn wood cap. And then there's also a wooden tuba stop here, which also has a fairly unusual construction. Uh, the bottom end is more typical of a of a reed. And again, this can be tuned either by moving the wire or by this slide here, which moves up across the opening. Mm -hmm. So it's sort of like a, a hooded pipe done out of wood.